for, for me it was having sort of seen it for a long time, even before I came to university, and thinking, yeah, I'd be okay at that. Um, I'd, I'd watched it for the only a couple of years previously, and I just quite into my pushes, so I thought I'd give it a go in, uh, when I was in first year. I just saw the notice that there was an audition on Wednesday afternoon, and I was there. What was it like meeting Jeremy Paxman for the first time? It was a bit bizarre. Um, <laughs> he, he seemed, um, he, was, he was quite nice to our team actually. I think I only remember being told off a little bit once. Had a beer with him. Got his autograph. I, I recited the Shakespearean sonnet to him. But shall I compare thee to a summer's day, oh, Jeremy? It was, it was first round flirtation. I, I, I think some of the teams take it very seriously and others don't. We, we took it seriously in the sense that we had practices and things, and, lo and lots of the teams do do that. Um, you, can, you can tell some of the teams uh, sort of treat it all as a bit of fun and others kind of really want to slaughter the opposition. I think we, we gelled quite well as a team. We, when, when things were getting a bit problematic, one of us would step up to the plate, <laughs> as they say in France. My main weakness is definitely <laughs> literature, but I don't think that matters too much with the rest of the team. So you turn up in the studio, get your makeup put on. Yeah. Thanks to Jeremy Kyle. <laughs> we, we saw some... Um, um, interesting things in the corridors from the Jeremy Kyle yeah. show. Blokes with full on head tattoos. Wishing as well though. Why do you guys think Manchester tend to do quite well at Uni Challenge? <coughs> Could it be something to do with the 40,000 students to choose? I think it's, yeah, a uh, big student population. I think we have a, a really good selection process which is organised by uh, the librarian Stephen and he, um, he does well with keeping the team together and building up a um, a team that complements each other subject-wise. I, I, I think maybe as well, sort of, red brick universities in general, you get a lot of very intelligent people, but people who are maybe from a much wider range of social backgrounds and have a wider range of interests maybe than some of the Oxbridge. Uh, have you guys been recognised in the street or around campus much since it started airing? I am on a regular basis. I've had Sort of this weekend, a man gave me the thumbs up outside Brixton Tube Station. Someone, st an old man, stopped his car to have a chat with me. Since the last quarter final and the, the first and the semi final, uh, quite a bit. I only get recognised when with Tristan. Mm -hmm. Paul, Paul and I were in a train station and I got recognised, and the woman who recognised me completely ignored her. They did, yeah, so it's, it's had a, I had a very bad haircut for the first few episodes. Sexy, it was a sexy fringe. Do you guys have an earliest memory of University Challenge? <laughs> yeah. Used That's to watch one. it at tea time. And I always used to, I'll tell you what, I always, when they had the Oxbridge Colleges with the strange names, it was a different world. I think I remember vaguely kind of freezing over it when I was living in Scotland, so I would have been about six or seven, um, and just thinking how ridiculously obscure everything was. Um, I suppose I gathered a bit more knowledge as I grew up, so it didn't become as much of a problem now. I remember the Paxman era before they had the string quartet music and they had the chime music. No, I don't remember that. Um, do you guys consider yourself intelligent? Because it's, it's an interesting question surrounding University Challenge, isn't it? Yeah, but I also consider myself Arik. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> Strike that. <laughs> <laughs> Finish up <laughs> uh, I, I don't particularly consider myself intelligent. I think I'm okay at kind of holding useless trivia, which came in handy with the show, but in terms of, you know, pe what people would usually class as intelligent, I wouldn't say that I'm intelligent. Oh, yeah. Excellent. Somebody yeah. sticking to their guns. No, I, no, I, I would. I'm I, sticking to my guns, I, that's I, true. <laughs> I, I'd, I'd consider myself intelligent, yeah. Why not?